this is a demonstration of U1 FTP, James Henstridge's work to allow anyone on any platform to access Ubuntu One via FTP. So here is James's website, uh, and I can click to download the zip file for U1 FTP, and Firefox will save it into my downloads folder as normal. So I say save, and it downloads. Okay, downloaded perfectly happily. Now let's start a terminal. So. I start a terminal, that comes up, and then I can run the downloaded file as per James's instructions with Python. So download u1ftp.zip. That's now running, as you can see it says it's listening on there. So at this point I've now got access to Ubuntu One with FTP. I can connect to it exactly the same way I connect to any FTP server with connect to server in the file manager. So if I bring up the file manager, starts up I can then say file connect to server it is a server which requires login so it's FTP with login it's on local host on port 2121 and then in here I just put in my perfectly standard Ubuntu one username and password Come and type my password in and then just say connect. At that point that connects and that's my Ubuntu One storage right there. I can do anything I want with it. So if I go into my pictures folder, I can then go into downloaded and here are my pictures. This is uh, a folder that I have synchronized with Ubuntu One. So that's stored in my Ubuntu One storage but that's accessing my stuff directly in the cloud. I can browse around it. I can open individual files. So if I click on a file it will open up and that's being downloaded directly from the cloud, directly from Ubuntu One itself and opened up, but it's acting exactly as though it's a local folder. I can open files, I can copy files directly off here onto my local disk, so I could just drag that, drop it on another folder somewhere and it'll be copied. I can copy files or save files into my Ubuntu One storage directly without having to save them locally and then have them synced. You know, I've just got a direct mount, a direct view of my of my Ubuntu One storage exactly in my file manager exactly I want it and it all works everywhere works on Fedora works on OSX works on Windows works on Ubuntu works everywhere so we hope you like it